away from Detroit. It was a long trip, so I'm gonna give y'all one piece, and I'm gonna get, get out y'all here. It's called Matrimonial Homicide. Okay. Yes. I waited on the opportunity to wait on you hand and foot, providing you with all the layers of meat until each one was peeled back in an attempt to break you. Each layer providing you another opportunity to get underneath my skin and rip you to shreds. I offered you my mind, my heart, my body, and my soul at my sanity's expense. I allow love songs to guide my affection that soothed your erection. You used deflection to undergird my tone. I walked on eggshells thinking that you were the world's last great man. For years, I allowed you to eat at the very core of my being, alongside the disease you gave me as a wedding gift. Now the growth of, the growth of my white cell count has no prime numbers because you chose the prime time to be primitive and primal. You peeled back the layer of promiscuity instead of monogamy, primarily because I let you. So who's at fault here? You for fucking over me or me for allowing you? Either way, I gave you 10 years of my life. You gave me 10 years of strife, and now I stand here with 10 years left to fight? Yeah. Statistically, I should hate you for short in my life, but sadly enough, I stand here still wanting to be your wife. Love's a bitch, and then I'll die. Well, if I'm lucky, I'll rest in peace with my head held high. My poetic family was scribe. Here lies a woman who never asked why. Too busy walking on eggshells and leaving footprints that smelled like his shit. <laughs> Every office of my body bleeds a different me. But I was brought up old-fashioned to respect my family and have some dignity. Only if I leaked an ounce of the behavior of a modern-day woman, I would have been left your ass and kept on pushing. Well, here I lie, a woman of substance, who has died for her right to continue breathing, mentally feeding and to believe without seeing. But even in my death, he continues to corrupt my character, constantly controlling me till cool grass grows over me. While I stick my hand out the grave, while the death still spitting my vows. As the earth watches my ring finger, as it takes one last vow. <laughs>